In this video, I'm going to cover matching your employees and positions, as well as sending your payroll data to ADP. After you purchase the connector from the ADP Marketplace, navigate to Apps, then select the When I Work app. You're then sent back into When I Work, where you can match employees and positions between When I Work and ADP. Let's start with matching employees. Click the Employees tab, then look through which employees have already been matched and which ones need matching. If there are employees in ADP that you don't want to match, select Ignore in the drop-down menu. Depending on how you like to view the matches, you can compare When I Work to ADP or compare ADP to When I Work to get your employees matched up. Select Add to When I Work if the employee doesn't exist in When I Work yet and you'd like to add them. When you're done, click Save to complete the matching process. Matching positions works the same way. Click the Positions tab, then look through which positions have already been matched and which ones need matching. Multiple positions can be matched with ADP departments. Again, you can compare When I Work to ADP or compare ADP to When I Work when matching up positions. If there are positions you want to add to When I Work, select Add to When I Work from the Matching drop-down menu. When you're done, click Save to complete the matching process. Make sure to always save any changes you make to employees or positions before leaving the page. When you add new employees to ADP, you'll need to add them through this process. To do so, you'll go to your integrations page in When I Work and select Manage in the Run Powered by ADP tile. Now that you've got all your employees and positions matched up, let me show you how to import hours into ADP. When you're ready, close your timesheet in When I Work then click Send to ADP Run. Log into ADP, then click Timesheet Import. The number of hours displayed in When I Work now displays in ADP. At this point, you have two options. If this is all the data you want to import, click Accept Import Only. If you have other separately entered payroll data, click Combine Payroll and Import. Click Approve to complete the import. And just so you know, Clicking Approve does not run your payroll. Modifications to imported hours are still possible. You will still need to complete your payroll process after you click Approve. That's it! For more information and frequently asked questions, check out our Help Center article on this topic.